there are several opportunities for the new item types on the STAR test for students to type in their responses. This is an example of one of the constructed responses in Cambium, where it gives them an article to read and then a prompt to write about, and then it says write your response in the box provided. Sometimes it's going to be asking for a um, extended constructed response. Sometimes it's gonna be asking for a short constructed response. And sometimes it's just going to be a text entry where students enter a numeric quantity, a word or a phrase. In Canvas, any of those types can be, um, try that, can be added by clicking on this add question button. And then on the essay, question type. Um, if you just want a basic writing prompt, you can enter the writing prompt here. And they it should automatically have selected the rich content editor, but that will allow students to type in their response. You can include the spell check showing the word count or setting a word limit depending on what you are wanting. Um, grading notes, you can add grading notes there, aligning it to outcomes, item banking, and adding your point value. And then, um, well, I need to change that. I'm going to take that off for modeling purposes. And then when you go to view it like a student will, they will read the prompt here, and then they will have the ability to respond to the writing prompt here and submit right here. Now, if you want to include a, let me exit the preview here. If you wanna include a stimulus with this as well, like a, um, an article for them to read or a poem for them to read, something like that, or it could just be a picture, you can first include a stimulus right here, put the title of the article or image here, you could include instructions here if you would like. And then you can include the content right here. Make sure you're checking for plagiarism or I guess I should say copywriting issues. But you could insert an image if you would like to insert an image by uploading it here. You could insert audio or video. It could be a variety of different um, stimulus that, or stimuli that you're putting in here. And then you could type in or copy paste your article or poem, etc. there. And then on the orientation, my recommendation is to put the questions to the right instead of below. One, this is just better for students to use. And also this is modeling Cambium's platform better. And you click down here. So the stimulus will be over here on the left hand side. And then you can attach multiple questions over here to the right again with text entry or short constructed response or extended constructed response you would want to use the essay button and then you can title the question and then enter your prompt here then again you can do the spell check showing word count setting word limits and such there setting your point value and click done if you have more than one question that goes with this article or image or whatever your stimuli is, your stimulus is, you can attach multiple questions here. So let's say on this one, you wanted it to be a multiple choice question. You could also include that there and then um, save it and attach as many questions as you would like. Um, I'm just going to type in something random here so you can see what that would look like. I'm going to delete those two. Done. And then so you can see it from a student side. Your stimulus would be over here to the left. Now, obviously, mine is very short because I didn't really include much. But if you had a story or an article or whatever, you would be able to scroll. Students could put their cursor here and scroll down and then they could um, answer the writing prompt or answer your multiple choice questions or whatever belongs with the stimulus.